Hey, rock stars, uh, don't be afraid. <laughs> I've been on bed rest past couple days. The coffee's bringing me back, no problem. Uh, but despite being on bed rest, I made sure that I did my duty as an American to vote today. It's a very important election. Um, I, I, I don't know what happened to my last video where I implored my friends, all my rock stars, to go out and vote but since I asked you guys to vote I had to make sure that I voted uh, despite how sick I am uh, and I'm a traditionalist I don't believe in early voting I believe there's too much room there for for fraud um, but like I said in the last video we're gonna see fraud voter fraud a lot of it here's what I don't understand before going to the polls I decided I'd run to the store and take care of a few things, do a little research, if you will. Had to go get some rum because it's that time of the year where, you know, people want to drink eggnog when they come visit, and I make a pretty nice eggnog. Or if I make an eggnog cheesecake like the uh like my friends out at the Fish and Wildlife uh services uh found out today, uh I do put a little bit of uh rum in my eggnog cheesecake. Um, and if, uh, if this year I, I attempt to make a fruit cake, I'm going to use the rum on that also. And as I walked up to the cashier, she asked me for my ID card. I said, okay, no problem. Went to the next store because, uh, you know, I, I, like I said, I've been sick. I've had a few shots. I got the greatest doctor in the world. He patches me together like nothing else. And, uh, I decided, well, let me try to get some cough medicine because I've got an irritating cough. And uh, I was asked for my ID to buy cough medicine. That was a new one on me. I decided, now, nah, you know what, I, I don't need the cough medicine. And then I said, wait a minute. I walked up to the uh, service counter and I said, uh, how much for a pack of cigarettes? I wasn't going to buy any, calm down. And the lady said, you know, it's like $7. I was like, darn, these smokers, woo. And she goes, can I see your ID? I said, oh, I'm not, I'm just researching. But there it is, three instances today that I was asked for my ID card. I go to the polling place, and all they did was ask me for my name. Didn't ask for an ID card. I gave her my ID card anyway. I don't understand why everyone is up in arms about showing their ID card to vote. You need it for just about everything else. You need an ID card to drive. You need an ID card uh, to register for any kind of schooling. You need an ID card to get a job. You need an ID card to, to buy any kind of, quote, controllable substance. You need an ID card to pick up... Uh, prescription drugs. My wife was picking up my prescription yesterday and they wouldn't give her my prescription because uh, they needed my ID card since most of them are, I guess, class two narcotics or something like that. It makes no sense, people. Why is this an issue? And then I started thinking about all the other things that are issues during this political time and, and it just baffles me. I'm not going to get on a soapbox today because I'm, 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 I'm still not feeling well. But please, if you haven't voted, we've got like two hours before the first polling place is closed. Please go out, exercise your duty, your obligation to America, and vote. And if you don't know who to vote for, think about this. No, I'm not going to go there. I'm not going to go there. Guys vote. Make it your obligation as legal citizens to vote because the illegals are going to outvote us. I went there. I'm going to take some more meds and hopefully I'll be up and around tomorrow. Later rock stars and if you are uh, at a loss of something to do uh, go watch Nadia G's Bitchin' Kitchen. Really good cooking hints. We'll see ya. Bye.